Yo, what is going on everybody? Welcome back to another video here on Akuma MC Skyblock and in this video we're going to be expanding our island and it's just going to be very very helpful to us for future farms and stuff like that so stay tuned to the very end. So to start things off we are going to try to expand our island so in order to do that if we go into slash is perks and we go ahead into the island size perk we basically need to mine 5k blocks in order to increase the uh, the current size and the current size right now is 80 by 80 and once we do get the 5k blocks it will increase the level and it will go to a higher island size which can be very very helpful for future farms and just so much more and then we can build a bigger wheat farm and yeah and basically with bigger farms we can actually unlock the is masteries faster so if we do such is mastery we're only on wheat currently and we only have mined 782 out of 10,000 to unlock potatoes and what we also do get cell boost and stuff like that for the rewards and stuff once we do level it up even more and the max is tactics and stuff so yeah we're definitely going to try to work towards this and with the island expansions we will actually get the more like space and we will actually be able to make bigger farms and stuff so it's just going to be very very helpful to us but in order to actually get the island upgrade you do need to mine 5k blocks so we're going to go ahead and do that in the slash mine so if we go there and right now we currently don't have a good pickaxe we just have the basic default pickaxe and i am still waiting on a my rank so once i do get that though it will be helpful to us i do have the second rank so it's in one of my chests so i could definitely actually claim that for a little bit better pickaxe but i don't really know it, this pickaxe isn't terrible honestly if you are just starting it is it has some decent enchants like the turbo mining and the efficiency too so yeah and i do recommend if you are starting out mining and you aren't insta breaking you want to mine back and forth like this basically go one way and it's gonna like half break all the blocks and then when you go when you go back it is going to break all the blocks and once you do get the turbo mining proc like the enchant so when it the turbo mining enchant procs you just want to like start mining everywhere because it will insta mine so yeah that's basically how you like efficiently efficiently mine so i do recommend to do that if you are if you do have a pickaxe that is not so good we did just level up our mining skill to level five which means we did unlock the iron farm which is a way better than coal farm but it still isn't the best so if we take a look in the slash skill section and we are going to go into the mining section so boom level five we did get a one percent mining speed boost 20 cloud keys and five chicken spawners so we're definitely going to take all of those we're definitely going to take the keys and the iron is just going to sell for more and just going to be way better than the coal and we did just get the turbo mining enchant so once we do that we just want to run around and start breaking everything another good thing about mining is you can actually get gems and with these gems you can go ahead and if we take a look at the slash shop but you can take a look into the gem shop and you can buy all these stuff for gems you can buy guardian spawners which cost two million gems which is kind of a lot we the max we've had was 5k and we bought a fire scroll with that and basically what the fire scroll does is if you apply it to a spawner it will auto set the mobs on fire and that's basically useful because mobs like the iron golems can actually only die to fire and instead of having to make like a lava farm or like stuff like that on the bottom where they will die in you can just have it spawn and once it spawns in the fire scroll will actually set it on fire and it will just instantly die and go into a crop hop or a chunk hopper so that is really good and if we take a look at the other stuff in the gem shop there's scroll of magic loot scroll i assume loot scroll just gives you more or loot i don't really know what this girl of magic does but then you have some satchels for some crops and wood and stuff like that and you just have like all these satchels for ores and you just have all these satchels for ores so those are pretty good and some of them don't cost a lot and we do have 5k gems so we can actually buy another one of the fire scrolls which is going to be useful and we, i think it's just probably what we're going to use our gems on i really don't see any other use right now currently and we will definitely get them gems back pretty fast once we do like level up our pickaxe and stuff because right now we have a pretty pretty bad pickaxe it is just the deal the the default starter one so yeah we definitely are going to try to do it. help upgrade it with some better enchants okay so we've been mining for a bit and i do want to go ahead and sell the stuff i've already gotten and i did get a mining book so i do want to go ahead and open that for some mining enchants and hopefully we get like efficiency or something but yeah let's go ahead and sell all of this so slash sell all and that made us around 40k which is actually not that bad because we are only in the iron mine and we'll only get better ores from here on so yeah we're definitely going to take that and i also want to check the uh ice perks to see how much blocks we've actually mined I think we're at, well, like 600. I hope it did get a lot more. And it's at 1.3k. Okay, we're definitely going to take that. But let's go ahead and work to the enchanter. And I actually want to enchant this book. See what good enchant we could get. And yeah, we're definitely going to have to grind the levels too. But we do have a decent amount. So it shouldn't take too long to actually get the levels to apply the enchant. And so we got Transfuse, which has the chance to give it us the next tier ore. We have Archaeologist, which gives us gems. And then we have Book Hunter. And that gives us enchant books, I think. Okay, Book Hunter would actually give us more enchants in the long run. That might be good. Archaeologist gives us gems, but we already do get gems. So so, I don't know about that one in the transfuse. I mean, we already have that too. So, I think I'm going to go I'm thinking I'm going to go ahead and go with book hunter. I want to see let's see how much it would actually cost to apply and okay, we can actually apply it and 
and it did go on so we're definitely going to take that and we did get a battle pass level up and i haven't actually taken a look at the battle pass yet i think we should have at least a few rewards okay five cloud keys and one xp pouch and 50k 20 cloud keys and 250k and then the last reward is 10 storm keys okay we definitely are, ha are gonna have to open up these keys that i've been getting i think i should have a decent amount and 47 xp not bad okay let me go to my island so i can go ahead and open up those keys real quick uh let me just empty out my inventory so i can see what i actually get and and so what if we do slash crates and okay so we have 65 cloud keys and 10 storm keys so let's go ahead and open up the cloud keys first let me just spam open okay so it looks like we got a value ticket let's open up that ak value not bad some more dungeon keys a total Whole bunch of cell ones and chunk hoppers honestly that is insane on um, how much we got uh two storm keys not bad and then i'm gonna go ahead and open up this pouch and deposit all of this cell ones and spawners and stuff okay i definitely have to apply those spawners to my farm let me had to actually go ahead and keep those and we did get a night rank which let's see on slash buy what to your rank it is and it is only the first rank so i currently have the first rank here and i should have the second rank here too boom at the first and second rank so that is not bad and then let's go ahead and open up those storm keys and slash crates and okay so we got two cell ones which have 250 uses not bad four enemy spawners okay we're definitely going to take that another rare chunk hopper and another value ticket okay so that was not bad at all let me go ahead and put these all these spawners down so slash fly and currently for the pig spawners we have three and then we add our we add them that's gonna be seven and then chicken spawners we're gonna have 20 of those now and then cow spawners five okay and then for the enderman we are going to have six now so yeah that's definitely going to be very very helpful I actually do want to go ahead and go ahead and sell the current chest we have so let me go ahead and find those okay so this one's almost full boom that's for 27k okay that is actually pretty good let's sell this one too let me sell these two and okay 38k and 35k okay we're definitely going to take all of that not gonna lie this farm is gonna be very very good once we do start getting more spawners and fire scrolls and stuff like that okay but we're gonna get back to mining because we do really need to unlock that ice perk so we're gonna go ahead and keep mining and we did get the book hunter enchant so we should be getting more books which is gonna help us in the long run with getting like efficiency and stuff like that because we really do need to help level up our pickaxe because we currently only have the starter pickaxe so yeah and then once we do that we're gonna be mining way way faster and we're gonna be getting more blocks mine pretty quick so yeah we're definitely gonna be looking forward to that and i just really want to get to that 5k blocks as fast as possible and we were about at 1.4k ish so yeah it shouldn't take us that long because we were only mining for a little bit and we already got 1.4k blocks so yeah i'll probably be back once i do get to 5k or if something interesting happens so yeah see you then okay so we were just mining and we did get another mining book so let's go ahead and open up that the enchanter and let's hope for some enchants that can help us mine faster that's basically the main goal we want on our pickaxe so something like efficiency or turbo mining or something like that so let's just see so we got book hunter which can give us more books and we already have the first one of that we have fortune which can drop multiple blocks and we have speed which gives us speed i think the best one here is probably speed or book hunter and this one's actually kind of a tough one because speed will actually make us faster but then book hunter will give us more books which would have the opportunity to get more books like efficiency and stuff but i think i might have to go with speed here because if we do run faster we will actually be more mining more blocks in the long end so let's see how much it will cost to apply and 34 levels okay that is not bad we can definitely grind that real quick so i'll be right back once i have grinded all that and, and when i am enchanting my pickaxe okay so we got the levels needed so let, let, let's go ahead and try to apply this on our pickaxe boom and it failed okay that's actually pretty unlucky uh that means we just didn't get anything from that and that is kind of yeah that's pretty unlucky for us that means we just basically didn't get anything so i guess we're gonna have to continue mining trying to get more books and stuff like that and in the process we're gonna be getting the blocks needed for the ice perks we're currently at about 2k which is not bad at all which means we just need 3k more in order to unlock the upgrade so i'll be back once i do either get another book or once i do get the mi blocks mined okay we got another book let's go ahead and enchant this one too so if we go ahead and go to the enchanter let's hope for honestly we just want efficiency we just want to mine faster so we can get the blocks done quicker and so we got value ticket finder which finds value tickets archaeologist which finds gems and turbo mining okay we're doing turbo mining because honestly the other ones are kind of useless for now and okay so let's see how much this will cost to apply and 71 levels okay that is actually kind of insane uh we're definitely gonna have to hold off on that one for a little bit uh, i probably will have to grind for the levels off camera or off video but we're definitely going to have to apply that one because it is a really really good enchant to have and we just don't have that xp right now but let's take a look at how many blocks we have just a little bit of an update and we do have 2.5k uh i might have to update a little bit so we might be at a little bit more but yeah so we're about halfway and we just did just get to level nine and if you take a look at these skills i think i mean 
I guess we probably will go to the next mine after. And we do get a 5% mining speed boost, which will definitely take 48 cloud keys and then 10 cow spawners. So yeah, and we I am looking forward to getting to that level 10. And hopefully it does actually put us into a new mine too, just so we could get more money and stuff. All right, this is my like third time enchanting for the mining books. So hopefully we could finally get a pretty good enchant that isn't like turbo mining which cost a ton to enchant so we got another turbo mining of course and then we got transfuse which has a chance to upgrade it to the next tier and then we got treasure hunter which finds keys and i honestly think we're gonna have to go with turbo mining here i i think the other chance are just not as good and let me just make sure they're both the same amount we need 71 there and let's see what the other one is and 71 okay so we might actually have to grind some blazes or something i really don't know i think i might just continue mining let me go ahead and take a look how many blocks we've mined it should hopefully be around 3k yes 3k okay that's not bad i think i'm just gonna finish out mining i don't really want to grind the xp right now i just want to get the blocks over with so i think i'm going to do that and yeah i'll be back unless i get another uh enchant or i'll be back once i finish mining or unless i get another book and hopefully i do get another book and get efficiency or something i don't even know if you get efficiency because i haven't seen the enchant yet but hopefully you can i'm pretty sure you can because it is already on the pickaxe i don't know how else you would get it but i might be missing something but hopefully we can get it but i'm just yeah, i'm just gonna continue mining and i'll be back once i either get two 5k blocks mined or once i do get another enchant book we did just get the mining skill to level 10 so let's go ahead and take a look at what we got real quick if we take a look in the slash skills you can see from the uh level 10 we did get five percent mining speed boost which is going to be very helpful 48 cloud keys 10 cow spawners and with that we also did unlock if we go back to the skills we did unlock the level two of the ultimate skills which you get just from progressing all your skills and we did get 32 storm keys from that so let's go ahead and open up those real quick or right, yeah i want to see if i can get anything good that could potentially help us in the mining process so okay nothing looks like nothing good from this so far and then let's go ahead and open up the storm keys and okay so we got a tempest key okay let's open up that one real quick our inventory is kind of full but let me just open it up real quick slash crates and okay this key is a little bit better so hopefully we get something good and uh, it's here too xp pouch okay we we'll definitely take the xp but i'm gonna go ahead and put this all into my chest and stuff like that and i'll just continue mining i just went ahead and enchanted a book and we did get the meter enchant which has the chance to unlock a or randomly spawn a meteor so that's gonna be pretty good it costs 55 xp levels so we're gonna grind that out out, but we are only like 500 blocks away from actually getting to the 5k blocks so we're gonna go ahead and do that real quick and i'll definitely be back once i do get it and it should go by pretty fast not gonna lie okay we have finally mined the 5k okay we have finally mined the 5k blocks that we need if we take a look in slash is perks our island is now 114 by 114 and our next quest is to farm 5k blocks so we're de we are definitely going to take that our island should be pretty big now and let me go take a look and yes it's noticeably bigger so that we're definitely going to take that we can build we can build bigger forms and stuff now and so it should be way more efficient and stuff but i think i'm gonna wrap things up there if you guys did enjoy it make sure to like and subscribe for more future videos and i'll see you in the next one peace out